everyone, welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swish and I'm reviewing the market. Sunday evening here, not quite uh, time for the futures to come out, about an hour or so. And we'll see where the market is tonight. Again, a lot of things going on overseas, uh, but overall the market is extremely, extremely strong. So again, when you look at the overall market and everything that's happening here, the reaction that we had after the rate cut, there's no reason to really think the market isn't going to just continue the uptrend, at least till after the election. So, of course, we have earnings season, and that could put a monkey wrench in things if we don't get earnings to push the market higher. But earnings season doesn't start for two more weeks. So that's a long time for the market to trade up. But I know everyone thinks the market's going to pull back. But to me, the market looks like it's ready to just break out higher. So numbers I'm watching are 575, 580. Um, you know, I mean, 600 looks like it could even happen for the end of the calendar year, which seems insane. But with good earnings and, you know, a good election outcome, at least the way the market would see it, um, this market could continue to push up higher, higher and higher. So I would not be surprised if we go to uh, some higher numbers here that would seem insane when you look back 12 months ago, considering where we're at and the fact that everyone thought that we were going to drop interest rates five times this year and so far we've had only one rate cut this year and I don't think we're going to have any more you know regardless of the election so very interesting marks extremely bullish be very careful what you look at shorting the irony is that I do prefer to short and I short most every day uh, occasionally I go long but I mostly short and the funny thing is again I've been doing that in a bullish market so if you'd like to learn how to short how to read directional bias in a stock chart and how to read the gap and the market uh, you can learn in my Golden Gap course, which is for October, October 19th and 20th. There's only three more classes this year. Classes are online. Looking forward to the fall. Uh, some beautiful days, hopefully, up ahead here in Manhattan. We've had tons and tons of rain and can't wait to get out, enjoy this fall scenery and trade my little heart out into the next couple of weeks of earnings season. Have a great week, everyone.